Hey, what's going on guys? It is Tanner at Ceramic Pro Sarasota and it is May 19th. What's in the shop Wednesday today? So we're gonna go check out what we got going on in the shop. All right, so starting off, uh, we got a couple boats in this week. So we're doing, uh, our marine division is doing a buff and polish and then a ceramic coating top to bottom on this brand spanking new boat. Um, initially, customer only wanted to do the underside of the boat. It's best to do everything. So we're getting it all covered for them, getting it protected from salt water and oxidation, you know, guts from fish, anything like that. So um, our guys have already gone through and buffed and polished this already. It's gonna get its coating today. It's gonna start, we're gonna start putting layers on the hull today. And then also the top side surfaces, we coat everything, pretty much everything except for non-skid surfaces because we don't want anybody to slip. Um, but glass, the hull, any fouling, metal, everything up there, center console, vinyl seats, everything on a boat gets coated. Um, so yeah, this is boat number one. We got another one over in the corner I'm gonna go to here in just a sec. And uh, yeah, so we got two boats this week. Continuing over from the boats, we got this blue Hellcat. Uh, we actually ceramic coated this about a month ago. Customer had some interesting smells on the inside. So we're doing an ozone treatment on this and going to hopefully get the smell out. Uh, that should be in and out today. And then he's gonna enjoy ceramic coating from there on out that we did last month. Uh, now we've got this Super WRX. This is a coating maintenance. So once a year, we advise to have a customer bring their ceramic coated vehicle in. We can go over everything, make sure that the coating's acting well and beating properly. Uh, and the underlying layers are still healthy. And then we can reapply an outer layer to give you a rejuvenation for the upcoming year. Um, so that will be in and out today as well. We've got this awesome 454 Chevelle SS. This thing is sweet. Don't see too many of these around. Um, we're doing a little bit of paint work on this. As far as I know, doing a paint correction as well. Gonna have to be careful on these. Uh, actually, these vinyl stripes are not vinyl, they're paint, so that's good. Um, but we're gonna be doing a paint correction on this and then a lifetime ceramic coating. So we'll get five layers on the whole body, coated windshield and wind side windows and mirrors, also wheels, calipers. You can see this, this car has got some pretty sweet uh, red Willwood brakes. So we're gonna coat those as well once we get the wheels off, polish the wheels on the back side and the front, and then coat the calipers and the barrel of the wheel along with the faces. So this thing is getting top to bottom coated. This is a lifer for this guy. So very cool car, excited to have this one in. We got a brand new 21 Jeep Gladiator. Uh, just put full XR, XBEL window tint on this. So full windshield, sun strip, and then 15% on the sides in the back. And uh, that comes with 88% infrared heat rejection, also 99% UVA and UVB rejection. Keep your skin safe, also the interior, and also keep the vehicle cool on the inside so you're not running as much AC. So that got tinted already. Customer's gonna pick that up today. Um, we tinted quite a lot of vehicles for him, so this is a return customer. He knows this is the best film on the market. Uh, over here, we got a Lexus IS250. We're doing a diamond detail too. We actually did most of the detail yesterday. We're just gonna finish it off this morning. Um, in the back there, we got another Jeep Gladiator, which is getting paint protection film and tint. So tint should start on that. If it already hasn't been done, I can't see from here, but. Um, and then it's getting paint protection film and then our sport coating as well. Keep in mind, everybody, we got that on sale this month for the month of May, love bug season. Um, over here, we got a white Ram 1500. Did Expel uh, window tint on that as well. And that should be getting also paint protection film, ceramic coating, paint correction before the coating in the film as well. Uh, so that's a, that's a all departments kind of truck right there. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's go inside the shop. In the detail bay number one, we've got a coating maintenance on this 5 Series BMW. Uh, we ceramic coated this vehicle last year for this client. Uh, you can see Tayshawn here is testing the hydrophobus 
hydrophobic properties of the coating. It is holding up very well, so good, good sign there. Uh, coating's doing very well on this car. Water's running right off. So that'll be in and out today. We're gonna finish it off with a full detail and then uh, probably apply another layer of coating just to be safe for another, uh, another year to come. We're over in the body shop. Andy and Nick, wherever Nick, there's Nick. Andy and Nick are working hard over here, sanding things down and getting stuff painted. Um, getting this Jeep Grand Cherokee front bumper had a little bit of damage, so repairing that. And then uh, it's also a ceramic coated vehicle, so we're gonna, gonna be doing a ceramic coating maintenance on this before it leaves. Uh, Andy should be getting this thing sprayed today. And then if you come this way, we're doing a return customer. Got a 911 Turbo S. This is a 21 brand spanking new. We're doing some paint protection film work on the front. Uh, had a little bit of damage up there from unknown circumstances. Going to remove and replace that and then also recoat that paint protection film once a new paint protection film is on. Uh, and then we're probably going to give it a full detail before it heads out. We like to give most customers a courtesy detail when they come in. All right, and over in this corner, <clears throat> we got a brand new Cadillac CTS-V. I love these cars, man. So we just did a full body paint protection film install on this car, actually a couple, I think it was a week or two ago. Um, so this is actually a satin paint protection film. This is called Expel Stealth paint protection film. So it'll change the sheen of a car from gloss to a satin finish. Uh, we did the entire car. We did also the roof and carbon fiber paint protection film, so that's not regular vinyl. This is a self-healing paint protection film that is warrantied for 10 years all the way around on this car. We did a lot of work on this. We blacked out the window trim, sent that to Andy in the body shop, sanded that down and painted it black. Also the bases of the mirrors, the door handles, the side emblems. We smoked out the headlights and the fog lights and the side markers. And the reason that it's back this week is because he wanted to do also the wheels. So we powder coated these wheels gloss black for him. And then we're probably gonna give it a full detail for it heads out. So that should be getting picked up today or tomorrow. Customer very pleased with this car. This is, this is a beautiful masterpiece, especially with Jake's work on the paint protection film. Um, moving over here, we got a Tesla Model 3 in for a ceramic coating maintenance. Also, uh, one of the vehicles that we're doing a coating maintenance in and out on today. So anytime you need your ceramic coating checked up on, it's not a long process. It's in and out in one day. You drop it off in the morning, pick it up at five or six o'clock in the evening. Um, this car looks phenomenal, considering it's a black Tesla, um, especially in the Florida sun. A lot of black vehicles around here get pretty beaten up, but this thing has held up very, very well with the coating. Uh, so we're gonna be getting that out today. Moving right along, we got a 04 Dodge Viper here. Uh, this one came in, my good friend Ed. Um, we, or, yeah, we're doing a paint correction on the entire car, ceramic coating everything. We did Expel XR Plus window tint, so 98% heat rejection and 99% UVA and UVB re rejection. And we did the powder coat on the wheels as well, along with the center caps, because they're metal center caps, so those will look cool. Um, and then this thing should be getting rinsed once more because the paint correction's done. We just got the wheels back on yesterday and should be getting rinsed once more and then into the coating room to get its three layers of ceramic coating for a seven year ceramic coating package. And then it is out hopefully tomorrow or Friday. Uh, moving back here, we've got a S550 Mustang GT. Uh, this thing's pretty sweet. I, I love blue vehicles. Blue is my color. We're doing a coating maintenance on this as well. So this customer got his car ceramic coated a year ago. Um, and we're gonna be going over everything, making sure the coating is well and holding up great and still hydrophobic. And then we're gonna send it on its way before the end of the day. In the corner over here, we have a 01 Boxster. And a good friend of mine brought this in to me. He's got, a couple, he had a couple of dings and dents on the front of the car. It did have a full front paint protection film install on it. Uh, we removed the old paint protection film where those dings and dents were, uh, putting new paint protection film on the front bumper 
doing a paint correction over the whole thing to make sure we get any other little swirls or scratches out. And then we're putting a one year ceramic coating on this. So this is a customized package here. Um, the one year ceramic coating combined with uh, multi-stage paint correction. This car is gonna look great, but it's a customized option. Uh, we're more than happy to do that, get every customer exactly what they want. Over in the far corner of the big room, we got uh, my good friend Dave's 2014 Harley Davidson trike. We're doing a five year ceramic coating on this, heavy paint correction. Uh, he definitely gets a lot of use out of this bike. He's in a couple of clubs and I know he rides around on a lot, so it needs a good bit of love on the paint. We're gonna correct it all up. Gonna put actually paint protection film on the side fenders, so prevent from the rock chips because those are the most forward facing pieces of the bike. And then we're gonna ceramic coat uh, two layers of our ceramic coating for a five year coating on that. Over here, we got a C7 VET. Uh, we're doing a paint correction. This actually is Z06. And doing a paint correction, we already did XR window tint, so 88% heat rejection, and then putting two layers of ceramic coating on this afterwards for a five year coating. Now, moving right along the paint correction aisle, we've got a 99-996-911 Carrera. Uh, also one of my good friends, Ben, this car is awesome. I really love this car. It's got some newer turbo twist wheels on it. Um, we're doing paintless dent repair, which has already been done. Paint correction is almost all the way done, and then we're gonna be putting a one-year coating on that as well. Same thing as the Boxster. It is a customized package, doing a combination of a couple different things. Uh, he should be picking this up today or tomorrow. This is a beautiful car, and a lot of 996s uh, are, are coming around now because they're just great cars. <laughs> all right, and over in this corner of the big room, we got another Harley Davidson. This bike is all blacked out. This is a beautiful bike. Um, we're doing a paint correction on this, heavy paint correction. It's a black bike. Um, actually, I think he just had it recently painted as well, so it's pretty fresh paint. Um, but we're doing a paint correction, multi-stage paint correction, seven-year ceramic coating, so three layers of coating will go on everything, and we do coat everything on this except for your uh, grips on your handlebars and your foot pegs. You don't want slip there, of course, but uh, we're gonna coat the seat. So we got the seat off, clean underneath that, coat everything. We're gonna coat the motor. Um, we have heat resistant ceramic coating for that as well. So anyone with questions on ceramic coating motorcycles, we coat literally everything on these bikes. Um, and we're also running a little bit of a, a pop-up sale for the month of May for bikes that come in to get a ceramic coating. We can ceramic coat your helmet as well. Uh, get any bugs off that, because of course, you know, you're gonna get some love bugs this time of the year. So moving right along, we got a Bentley Bentayga. Um, full paint correction, ceramic coating. We already did XR Plus window tint on this all the way around with the full windshield. So he's gonna have nice and cool interior. Uh, this is getting a seven year ceramic coating. So three layers, if I'm not mistaken, it should be a seven year coating. Um, Matt is working on the paint correction right now. This car was actually previously buffed on, we noticed. Um, there was some improper buffing techniques used on the other side of the car. So that kind of stuff does come up even on brand spanking new vehicles. He is the first owner of this right off the lot. Um, but something must have happened where it had gotten buffed on before and it was done improperly. So we're correcting all of that, making sure that this black paint is flawless before it gets coated and then he'll be able to enjoy it for years to come. All right, so in the ceramic coating room, uh, we got the blinds closed in here to keep the humidity and temperature down when we're coating vehicles. We've got over here a, looks to be a 2013 Golf R. We did a paint correction on this, also a frequent flyer here at Ceramic Pro Sarasota, one of our really good clients. He's brought us plenty of vehicles. We do actually have his 911 GT3 here as well, getting a paint correction. Uh, this is his son's vehicle. Want a paint correction on this. You can tell that they're a Volkswagen, Audi, Porsche family. Um, we have here a Genesis Coupe. Another one of my good buddies, Jimmy, he's got this in for painting the front bumper. We're gonna be doing, we already finished a paint correction on the rest of the car. Should be getting coating soon. Um, we're redoing the smoke on the headlights because those were peeling up a little bit from whomever previously did them. Uh, and then it'll head out of here 
We're also putting some decals on the back before we ceramic coat everything and he's on his way. We did also uh, wheel refurbish on the passenger side on both wheels. There was a little bit of curb rash there. Uh, so fix those up for him and, and resprayed those wheels. We got an Audi Q7 here that is getting a full interior and exterior ceramic coating, paint correction beforehand. We also did full XR window tint all the way around, 88% heat rejection, full windshield as well, keeping uh, cool inside the car and heat on the outside. So that should be starting to get coated today. We have a Range Rover in here, also a paint correction ceramic coating. This is gonna be a five year coating, so two layers will go on this beautiful white Range Rover. Uh, we also did XR on the full windshield for 88% heat rejection there. And then moving right along, we have another uh, Range Rover here. This is an SVR. This thing's pretty sweet. Um, I know the owner of this one. He should be very happy with this. We got our guys putting on paint protection film currently on the B pillars and the C pillars and the D pillars. Uh, John is putting that on because what a lot of people don't know about these pillars is that they're plastic. They scratch easily. So even after we do a paint correction on them, they can scratch easily just from washing them. So John there is putting paint protection film on all the pillars up and down the car. Should be getting some more paint, prote paint protection film up front and then a ceramic coating over top of everything. Now, moving into the tint room, got this beautiful M5 here. We're doing full XR plus all the way around on this full windshield. You can see Jay and Main got the windshield laid out currently. They should be sticking that on the inside here soon. And we also have a Mazda CX-5 in the back. Emily's Mazda is getting XR all the way around, 88% heat rejection, full windshield as well with a clear film. So it doesn't uh, impede your vision or visibility at night, but it still blocks all the heat. Moving right along, we got another Range Rover in here getting paint protection film work on the front of it. And I, I'm pretty sure that's all it is. So it's just paint protection film, then it'll be on its way. Um, Mateo is working right now to clay bar and make sure everything's good and spick and span before we put the film on, make sure there's no bug guts or anything like that. We do give every vehicle a wash before it comes in for paint protection film and clay bar it. But Mateo is doing a double check right here, clay bar it again. It's always better to be safe than sorry when putting on film. All right, so that wraps up what's in the shop Wednesday, everybody. Uh, I'm standing out front here to close it out. We've got the 911 GT3 that I mentioned earlier. So the Golf R is in the back. We got the GT3 up front. We already finished up the paint correction on this. We're actually swapping out wheels as well. Uh, this is a beautiful car, so I just wanted to stand in front of it. Um, but yeah, so any content that didn't get covered in there, we're gonna be releasing all content for this week's services this weekend. If you didn't see your vehicle, by all means, feel free to get a hold of me. 941-993-0137. Uh, any questions, comments, concerns, or if you want to get booked into coming to the shop. Have a good week, everybody.